I read something the other day. They said one in seven people will have a foreclosure on their record by 2012. It's the first time I've ever been ahead of a trend. <laughs> like, sweet, I may have two by 2011. Look at that. <laughs> Start to get behind on your payments, then they call with their stupid. What are they, the first thing they do when you miss a payment? Raise the rate. Oh, that's help. <laughs> You're drowning, they throw you a rock. <laughs> then they call with their stupid trend. Hello, sir, we want to tell you that you uh, make you aware you've missed a payment. Really, I hadn't noticed. That pile of multicolored bills on the table didn't alert me to that. I didn't really. You do realize that's going to look bad on your credit. Ooh. <laughs> well, do you know if you don't make this payment, you may not be able to get another loan. <laughs> well, I can't make the payments on this one, sir. <laughs> and he goes, do you realize you signed a contract with us? Yeah, I do, but do you know what the terms of that contract were? No payments, no interest. <laughs> I believe I'm keeping up my end of the bargain. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I still have no interest in making no payments. <laughs> That's when he got really pissed off. He goes, do you realize we're gonna garnish your wages? So do you realize this week I'm working in a strip mall between a Dollar General and a Radio Shack? <laughs> You'll be garnishing that with a lemon wedge and some parsley for all you care. That's... Oh, hard to keep up with money these days, especially now I got five kids. Yeah, no. Blended family, I got two factory and three aftermarket. <laughs> oh, people, people freak out. They go, oh man, how are you gonna put five kids through college? Easy. They're not all gonna make it to college. <laughs> I'm saving up for three tuitions, bail and rehab. 